track that make you be right down your block. What's up? Hey, I got a question off the, just off the rip. I want to know what does Frontline Ministries mean to y'all? Like, what do y'all think about when you think about Frontlines? Or, like, what have y'all experienced with Frontlines? I want to hear one person at a time. Tell me about Frontline Ministries. What's up, y'all? My name's Everett Burge. I've uh, been drug free for five years now. And I've been patting myself on the back with that. The whole time I've been drug free, I've been a hardcore alcoholic. So I've never really accomplished anything. I've been a substance abuse addict for over 12 years of my life now. And by God's grace, I've drank the last drink I'm going to drink. I'm living in freedom. Come now. on. And by God's grace, I'm Thank continue you, living in freedom. Come on. And I'm just blessed. I'm blessed. And I'm here because Frontlines Ministry met me on the beach skimboarding and started sowing in my life. And it's been over a year and a half now that they've been sowing into my life, not through condemnation or judgment or coming down on me for what I do, but simply by loving me on the beach while we skimboard. And that's how Frontlines Ministry is reaching people, by being out there on the streets, just loving people for who they are and where they are. Amen. And now I'm where God wants me to be, and I'm living in His grace. Come on. Man, that's fine. Come on. Hey, it's by the blood of the Lamb and the word of the testimony that they overcame the enemy. And I believe there's power in our testimony. There's power in what Jesus has done in our life. And there's power in the blood of the Lamb. The Bible says that it is for freedom that Christ has set us free. I'm Lauren Lay. I'm 27 years old. I was a heroin addict. I had six felony charges. Was hopeless. Thought I was worthless. Thought there was nothing more to life than to just commit suicide. Goodness gracious. Oh, Jesus. But God has brought me from a different place. Brought me out of the darkness into the light. Has saved me. Has made me. Has redeemed me. Has made me worth something. Come on. A daughter of the Most High King. Come on. And I will forever serve Him each day that I live. In Come Jesus on. Name. Thank yeah. The Lord. That's it. Amen. Testimony of God's goodness. What's up? My name's Lynn. I used to be out there on the streets, man, living for the devil, man. And I thank God that. You know, God's hand was fit to come and change me and bring me to a place where I could more learn about Him. And I just love God today, and I'm so thankful for His grace and mercy. And we have all these guys from Frontline that do just such a good job in this uh, in this general area, man. Baldwin County's got a lot of good things going on, and uh, Frontline's doing a lot of big things, man. So come on. we just love y'all for it, and thank you, Jesus, for saving our lives. My name is Jacob Guzman, and I'm from San Diego, California, and I've been struggling with with these drugs for a little bit. I used to play professional baseball for the Kansas City Royals and Milwaukee Brewers and some other teams and thinking that I was so high and all the way up and now I don't have too much, but I gave my life completely to the Lord yeah, and I've on. never been more free and more rich. Come Mike, come big on. fish, baby, front lines, love come you. On, yeah, come on, man. Hey, I want to give a shout out to Isaac for all your labor. I remember meeting you at a hotel when it wasn't nothing but a vision. But man, this is your vision come true. These are just a few testimonies of yours on this bus. And man, Frontline Ministries and, and Big Fish Ministries tie in so well. It's, it's because of people like that are in this bus right here that say, you know what, I come from the street, but I need to get more of a foundation. And we're so thankful for Big Fish Ministries helping us get that foundation, getting straight Bible studies day in and day out, you know, getting to, to serve the community and just uh, to have a free program. They come and get, get their lives right and even get some of their court sentences wiped away because Jesus came to give mercy. Amen. Ain't that awesome? Come on. come on, man. God came to, to clean off my rap sheet. I'm just so thankful for that. They probably think I'm rolling, I ain't on luck. They probably think I'm rolling, I ain't on luck. They probably think I'm rolling, I ain't on luck. But what I got you, if 